Hi, I'm Adi Alpha and I'm the makeup expert for the Body Shop store in Soho, Oxford Street. Now, today we thought we'd go for something that's quite natural and radiant and glowy, which is really suitable for a job interview. Obviously now it's January, so everyone's looking for a new job, a new start and a new you. So we thought a nice, fresh approach to makeup would really suit that. To start that, we need to prepare the skin. So first of all, I'm going to be using our Nutriganics Drops of Youth, which is my favorite product. Um, you just need one drop for the face and neck. So I'm just gonna apply that. Now the eyes are important. You want them to not look tired. So I'm going to use our Drops of Youth Eye Concentrate. So again, just one drop. I'm going to apply that under the eye over in a figure of eight, like so. And because it's a roller ball, it massages the eye area as well. It's really good for fine lines wrinkles and the excess I'm just going to tap into the skin and then to moisturize the face as I said I'm going for a really radiant look I'm going to be using our vitamin C moisturizer which has got SPF 30 so vitamin C is really good for promoting radiance in the skin and giving you a nice natural glow again only need a small amount I'm just going to massage it into the skin My face is prepped for the makeup products that I'm going to be using, so I'm just going to move on to the makeup now. To start that, I'm going to be using our all-in-one Insta Blur Primer. Now what the primer does is it mattifies the skin instantly, so it takes off the shine. It also smooths over any open pores, fine lines and wrinkles. So now I'm going to use our all-in-one BB Cream. I'm using shade 04 because I've already skin matched the colour. And to apply that, I'm going to use our retractable blusher brush. And the reason for this is because I want to kind of buff it into the skin. So I'm just going to blob it onto my skin like this. The reason I'm doing that is because I'm leaving it to kind of activate on the skin before I blend it in. I'm just going to work it in. And you can actually apply a good few layers because it is really natural and light on the skin. Now I'm going for the radiant look, so I'm now going to use our radiant highlighter. I'm going to apply this just here, like so, and here, just under the eyes, down the nose, like so, under my brow bone, so it looks a bit like war paint, <laughs> but once it's all blended, it will look good. I'm just going to use the retractable bl blusher brush again. Okay. I want to focus on my eyes. So I want them nice and concealed, nice and fresh. So I'm going to use our Lightning Touch Concealer. I'm using 05 shade. I'm just going to apply that under my eyes here. You don't need too much, but again, it depends on how little sleep you've had. But if you're going for a job interview, I'd like to think that you've had enough sleep. Okay, so now I've completed my base, I'm now going to do my cheeks. And to do that, I'm going to be using our Baked to Last blusher in 01. Just using a blusher brush. It comes in two shades which is really good because you can get a nice natural radiant colour. I'm just going to smile, get the apples of the cheeks and I just apply that in a circular motion up to the hairline like so. So the next thing I'm going to use just to even all that out and blend it all together is our Honey Bronze Bronzer. I'm using shade 04 for that and the thing I love about this is that it's actually quite matte. So even though we've put all these glowy products on, we don't want it too garish. So this will tone it down a little bit. I'm gonna just do it along the hairline, just down the nose, chin, swoop it over a little bit, cheeks. So now my base is finished, I'm ready to go into my eyes. Now to start that, I'm going to be using the eye concealer. So this is our all-in-one Insta Blur Eye. I'm just going to put a small blob on my finger, or you can use the blender brush. I'm going to use my finger today. Kind of gently work that into the eye area like so. So now I'm ready to apply my colour. So for that I'm going to be using Golden Girl Colour Crush colour, which is 240. And I'm going to apply that with our blender brush, which is this one. So I'm just going to put the colour onto the brush, tap off the excess, and then just apply it. Gently onto the eye. 
can even use a little bit just underneath as well, just give your eye that nice glow. So now I'm ready for my eyeliner. So for that I'm going to be using our Smoky 2-in-1 Gel Eyeliner. I'm using the brown colour, it's just coming black and brown. Okay, so I'm just going to pull the eye across like this so I can see. I start from the middle of the eye and just gently stroke it across where the lash line is. My flicks. Now I've got my eyeshadow on, I've got my liner and then just to finish that off I just need to do my mascara and my eyebrows. So the mascara I'm going to be using today is our Super Volume Mascara in 01 Black. And voila, my eyes are nearly ready. I'm going to use our brow and liner kit in 03 just to finish off my brows and which also frame the face so it's very important. So you want the eyebrows to finish where the eye ends on the angle, like so, and start where the eye begins. So if you imagine an imaginary line. So I'm looking at here. Great. What I want to do now before I do the lips is just set the makeup with some loose powder and a bit of highlighting bronzer. And this one has quite pinky, um, browny, golden tones which complement every skin tone. I'm just going to apply that with our face and body brush. I'm just going to pop it into the product, shake off the excess. I'm just going to do this down the nose here, a little bit on the forehead and on the chin as well. Not too much, just a little bit to get that glowy effect. Then to set it all, I'm going to use our loose powder in shade 03. Now it is actually quite pale when you see it, but because it's quite translucent, it's not going to alter my, my skin tone or anything. So this is just to set the makeup, take off any extra shine on the skin. Now to finish the look with my lips, I'm going to start with some lip liner. One of my favourite shades is the Mahogany 06 because this really complements my lip colour, my natural lip colour. You can choose one that suits your, your lip colour and skin tone, I'm going for this one. So I'm going to start with the Cupid's bow and just move it outwards. Now a lot of people are scared to use lip liner but they're very versatile. Lip liner is a really good trick for giving that full lip look as well. And to finish it off, I'm going to use our Colour Crush Lipstick 315. You can either use a lip brush or if it's your own lipstick, I'm just going to apply it straight onto the lips. So now I've done my look, I'm just going to finish that off with a finishing spray and to do that I'm going to use our Vitamin C Energising Face Spritz. Just hold it slightly away from your face, close your eyes and spritz all over. And it's done! There you have it, I look suitable for a job interview or a new start for January. If you liked it or you found it helpful, give it a thumbs up and like the video. You can also subscribe to our other videos at thebodyshop.com and please let us know any other looks that you'd like us to create as well. Bye for now.